Kevin Owens is walking into enemy territory. It's no holds barred in Toronto, and the prize fighter has arrived. The following contest is a no holds barred match. Making his way to the ring from Marieville, Quebec, Canada. Weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens! I would suspect that Kevin Owens never thought he would be ended up here tonight. Edge was simply a pawn in Kevin Owens' game to remind the WWE Universe and specifically remind the WWE locker room just how dangerous Kevin Owens could be. But as we just mentioned, there is consequences to your actions, and Kevin Owens is going to have to face those consequences right here tonight in Edge's hometown of Toronto, Ontario, Canada. So Scotiabank Arena is about to blow the roof off upon the Rated R Superstar's return. The Rated R Superstar is back in action. Welcome home, Edge. For the first time since Survivor Series inside Hell in the Cell, the Rated R Superstar, the ultimate opportunist, Edge is back inside the squared circle and he's got revenge on his mind. Kevin Owens, be careful what you wish for because you just might get it. And his opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada, weighing in at 249 pounds, the Rated R Superstar. Kevin Owens wanted to remind everybody just how dangerous he was. Well, he may have bitten off more than he can chew because if we know anything about Edge is that over the last 25 years, he has shown just how dangerous the Rated R Superstar can be inside of that very ring. It is a big fight feel. I got chills. Toronto is on fire. No holds barred. This has been looming since Survivor Series. Edge and Kevin Owens for the first time ever, and it is underway. Edge has got to be careful. You see, he ran at Kevin Owens there, and Kevin Owens took advantage. Edge has got to make sure his emotions don't get the best of him here tonight at the Royal Rumble, and he wrestles and or fights his style of matchup. Edge wanted no holds barred, Kevin Owens accepted, and of course Edge wanted this stipulation because of the events that took place on the Raw after Survivor Series, the night of the draft, when Kevin Owens put Edge through not one, but two tables, and left him laying on cold hard concrete after a stunner in the backstage area. Edge was already nursing injuries from Hell in the Cell just a few days prior, Kevin Owens did nothing to help those injuries, only exaggerated them even more. Edge was left home for weeks nursing those very injuries. This is his first matchup back since Survivor Series. And you saw it in the eyes of the Rated R Superstar making his way down to ringside tonight. Edge is ready to get his hands on the prize fighter. And the brawl has been taken to the outside. Remember, no count outs, no disqualifications in this matchup. No holds barred, anything goes. This matchup can only end by pinfall or submission inside of the squared circle. But right now, I don't think Edge has even got a pinfall or submission on his mind. It's simply about giving Kevin Owens a taste of his own medicine. And the Rated R Superstar is wasting no time. A table reminding Kevin Owens of the wood that he put Edge through back at the draft in November. Edge has obviously got plans for the wood of the table. He's obviously got plans to hurt Kevin Owens here tonight. Edge has been sitting on this at home in Asheville, North Carolina since November. And now he's back in his original hometown of Toronto tonight to get his hands on the prize fighter. And Edge is setting up that table at ringside. Ringside's already dangerous as it is. You get a wood of the table out here, it's only going to escalate the situation even more. Edge is not wasting any time bringing in the hardware. He wants to bring the fight, bring the punishment to Kevin Owens, make him feel what Edge felt all those weeks sitting at home nursing those injuries. Kevin Owens avoiding disaster, Owens heading into the ring, and I wouldn't be surprised if Kevin Owens is more interested in keeping this fight inside the squared circle. Kevin Owens might have agreed to no holds barred, but 
I'm sure he knows that Edge is coming out hot tonight. And is looking to injure Kevin Owens. And I'm sure the prize fighter is looking to avoid that at all costs. Scott Edge in the corner right now is just pummeling the hometown hero here at the Scotia Bank and a shot right to the side of the head. You also gotta wonder, what is Kevin Owens' psyche after he tapped out to Matt Riddle this past Monday night on our Raw? We saw the tweet from earlier in the week. Kevin Owens might be brushing off that loss to Matt Riddle, but that goes a long way in messing with your psyche, especially heading in to big time matches here. Oh my goodness, a senton in the outside. Edge getting crushed between Kevin Owens and the floor of this arena. A senton in the outside. Throwing caution in the wind, does Kevin Owens. All in the name of trying to put Edge back on the shelf. And Kevin Owens just trying to raise his stock once again here in the WWE. Now whipping Edge around ringside, Kevin's heading back into the ring. Oh, wait a minute, Kevin Owens is going back up to the top rope again, again! A senton on the outside. He's looking to break a damn rib of a rated R superstar here tonight. We only know so much about Edge's condition after Survivor Series and Hell in the Cell on Thanksgiving night. And then the attack from Kevin Owens just a few days later. Edge, this is his first matchup since Thanksgiving, but what is the condition of the rated R superstar? competed in Hell in a Cell, a match that changes your career. There's no way that Edge is coming in the same man as he was a few months ago. He just gets whipped, whipped into the steel steps there. His ribs gotta be crying for mercy right now after getting squashed in Kevin Owens. Owens is targeting on that midsection, the rib cage of Edge here tonight. It has become obvious. And now a fall away slam, and Edge is going to be feeling this one. Win, lose, or draw in the morning. Double sentons to the outside. Edge is trying to fight back. We know how tough Edge is. We've seen him go literally to hell and back in just recent history. Any mortal man is going to feel the damage of maneuvers such as Kevin Owens is putting on right now. A super kick by Edge, trying to mount some momentum and no holds barred. Edge in front of a hometown crowd tonight. Trying to give back to his people here in Toronto. Looking to give them a win. A feel-good win upon his return to Canada. Edge is trying to get back into this fight after it was all Kevin Owens the last few minutes. Edge has got his eyes on that table again. Kevin Owens trying to avoid it. And Edge just smacks Kevin Owens over the chrome dome with the wood of the table. Moving in a position here. I don't know what the Rated R Superstar has got in mind. Sending Kevin Owens into the table. I'm sure Edge would love to give Kevin Owens a taste of his own medicine. Owens put Edge through not one but two tables back in November. Edge wants a little bit of that tonight and he just sends Kevin Owens. Owens goes rolling over the table. Edge ain't satisfied yet. Rated R Superstar heading back into the ring and now heading to the top rope himself. Kevin Owens has got his back turned. He's got no idea what's coming his way. Missile drop kick by the Rated R Superstar. Edge laying out the prize fighter and a flatliner on the outside. Kevin Owens eats the floor. Edge's wheels are turning. He's eyeing up that table and he isn't gonna be satisfied until Kevin Owens feels what Edge felt back in November. A power bomb through the table. The Rated R Superstar is on fire here tonight. Edge knows the Royal Rumble very well. He's won world championships here at this event. He's won the Royal Rumble match not once but twice. But tonight isn't about just winning for Edge. It's about payback. It's about retribution. And it's about giving Kevin Owens what Edge was feeling back in November. Kevin Owens eats the table off the power bomb, trying to fight back here. As Edge was starting to build momentum, but Kevin Owens fell to come, and you see the sense of urgency in those beady son of a bitch eyes of Kevin Owens. And dropping Edge with a DDT in the ring. 
Now KO going back up to the top. We've seen him go high risk already in this matchup. Frog splash by Kevin Owens. Already on, which I'm sure are the painful rib cage of Edge. Into the cover, and Edge gets the shoulder up at two. I'm sure Kevin Owens would like to get this matchup over with as soon as possible. Sends Edge back over the top rope. Edge not even able to catch himself. Just goes right down to the floor. And Edge fights back. Goes for the drop kick again. Kevin Owens able to avoid it. Fight continues on the dangerous outside of the ring. And Kevin Owens dropping Edge here at ringside. No holds barred stipulation being taken to its fullest advantage by these two combatants here tonight. Well, this is what Edge wanted at the end of the day. He wanted no rules or restrictions against Kevin Owens. Counters out whatever Owens had in mind. Oh my goodness, look at the strength. Electric chair position, and Kevin Owens goes face first on ringside. And Edge off the top. Or excuse me, off the apron, squashing Kevin Owens, and out back under the ring goes the Rated R Superstar, and he's got a steel chair. Well, Owens avoiding it, and Owens sending Edge right into the ring post here. Kevin taking a minute for Toronto to enjoy him, but Edge has got something else in mind. Can't turn your back on the former world champion, and Edge cracks Kevin Owens with a steel chair. That's got to feel good for the Rated R Superstar. Weeks in the making for Edge, and he's finally getting his hands on Owens tonight. Trying to beat him down with that steel chair. Owens avoid at that time. Oh, and Kevin Owens again avoids it. Edge up in the ring. Kevin Owens heading back into the ring. Edge grabbing that steel chair. Gonna meet Kevin Owens in there. Oh, wait a minute! Stunner! A stunner out of nowhere! You gotta be kidding me! No! Edge got the shoulder up at damn near 2.9. Edge slid back into the ring with the chair. Kevin Owens caught him with the stunner. Edge didn't even see it coming. Goes for the drop kick on Kevin Owens. Owens able to avoid it. Owens laying Edge out. Edge had something in mind with that steel chair. KO avoided it, and now Edge face first goes Kevin Owens. Here, what the hell? Oh my God! You have got it, Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn has hit the ring. The best friend of Kevin Owens is here in Toronto. Exploder suplex on Edge. What the hell is going on? You have got to be kidding me. Sami Zayn is here, and he's beaten the hell out of Edge in his hometown. I know it's no holds barred, but this is absolutely bulls... Ugh. Sami Zayn, what the hell is he doing here? He's been going with an injury over a year here in the WWE. Kevin Owens' ass is laid out, and Sami Zayn is back here. The Great Liberator just laid out the Rated R Superstar. This is ridiculous. Sami Zayn picking up Edge for Kevin Owens to feed on the scraps. Oh, come on now, Edge. Edge is in trouble. A power bomb to the outside. The already injured rib cage of Edge that has been worked on this entire match by Kevin Owens just takes that fall to the outside of the ring. This is absolutely ridiculous. Kevin Owens is heading to the top rope and a swanton by the prize fighter. Owens into the cover. You have got to be kidding me. Edge just got screwed in Toronto. Edge did everything he could, was out for payback tonight, was out for retribution on the man who put him on the shelf back in November, and that son of a bitch Kevin Owens had a backup Here plan all along. The return of the Great Liberator, the return of Kevin Owens' best friend, Sami Zayn, and the KO and Sami show just screwed Edge here tonight at the Rumble.
You know, the result of this match is one thing, but I would be careful what Kevin Owens and how Sami Zayn wish for because tonight was supposed to be payback for Edge, but those two men may have bit off more than they can chew with the rated R superstar. Absolutely bull. Oh my goodness. Taste on when I chase like that, yeah, I play so strong with a knife in the back, I'm a swing home run like a baseball bat, gonna see me rise, you can hate on that, I don't play both sides, don't need no cap, I'm a rapper.